Hello, my name is Chris. I'm with Performance BMW, and today I'm going to give you a walk around of our 2013 BMW 528i X-Truck. This video was made for Bruce. I understand you're looking at an X5 and also wanted to possibly consider it a 5 Series. But in this video, I'm going to show you just a little bit about our car here. So, we're at Performance BMW. Okay, now this 5 Series in particular actually has the M Sport package, so you can see it has the aggressive uh, front and rear bumpers. You have your 18 inch M wheels that came with the car. And this is the dark graphite metallic. So it's a very dark gray. Very, very beautiful color. Okay. Now coming from an SUV, some of that might be important would be the, uh, the room in there, right? Like, will, will this car have enough room for me? Let's just, uh, let's see right away. By the way, this is your oyster leather interior. It's the uh, comfort seats as well. So uh, you see you have your little, uh, some pillows up here you can adjust to kind of wrap your head a little bit. It's more comfortable. These seats were also featured in the uh, BMW 7 Series and this was an optional package for this year on this BMW. So right now I have the seat about where I usually would have it. There's your M badge as well. Getting into the back, there is still plenty of room. It's uh, it's it's your uh, business class sedan. Lots of room back here. Uh, if you're considering either an SUV or a sedan, this would be the way to go. Okay. Now, on the interior features, there's uh, quite quite a lot of. Uh, things to go over here. All this we can go over in person in detail. You would have stuff like your heated steering wheel, which is just over there. Uh, some uh, driving assistance, there forward collision warning, lane departure, uh, dual zone climate control, heated seats, and your iDrive command wheel. One thing that's important to note is uh, this vehicle was actually has a rear damage claim on it, but if you look at it, when you look at the gaps, I know the rear bumper was replaced, but if you look all the way down at the gaps are consistent, you can't even tell that it was in an accident. And the value that it has on the damage claim is uh, it's not an alarming amount because uh, you see the rear bumper has some parking sensors as well. So all that factors into the repair. So that's why it can, can be a costly repair for, for something like a, like a rear bumper. But if you see down here, gaps, that's what's mo most important, what you want to follow is, is the lines. And you can see it's uh, it's consistent all the way all the way around. So it, it was prepared professionally at a professional body shop down to the manufacturer specifications. All right. Once again, this video was made for Bruce and Ruth. Thanks for watching.